So today I would like to do a cooking video. I'm basically going to just wing it, do whatever I feel like I want to do and put whatever in the pot and keep it going. I'm I'm going to do like a a um stew. A uh, um turkey wing stew. And I just felt like I cook every single day. So today I actually was like, you know what? Let me just record it because I love to cook. I'm a cooker. I have three girls and I have to cook every day. So basically I'm going to start off by vegetable oil in the pot. And let that sit a little bit. So what I'm basically going to do is I'm going to put let it um heat up a little bit so the oil can get hot i'm going to turn it on medium heat medium medium low so that it don't burn too fast i'm going to season my meat this is actually the meat this is turkey wings and i got it cut up into pieces It's cut up and I'm basically gonna add my seasoning. So what I did was I turned the heat on in the oil and then I have vegetables here. Not vegetables, yeah, vegetables that I'm gonna fry. I'm gonna fry that. So let's go ahead and season. I'm gonna put a little bit of curry powder because I love curry. she's crying so guys come with me while I get my baby she's waking up let's look at her guys look at her Ari hey mommy she is so uh oh she's waking up so she's gonna want a bottle I'm gonna get her and make her a bottle. Sure, you can feed her. Hold this for me. Keep it right there. She's waking up. Yeah, she's really. She's always waking. She, um, what time she always wake up, mommy? Um, about every three to four hours. Yeah, three to four hours. So there she. Look how cute she is. Hi, say hi to the vlog. <laughs> hi, mommy. Say hi. Say hi, guys. Why is your face like that, Ari? Mm. Let's go tell Lele to make a bottle. Okay, come on. Let's go. So, make a this is my balcony. So, anyways, you see how I just stopped in the middle of cooking? The grease is still boiling. This is my view, guys. This is my balcony. Little one that needs to eat. I'm stirring up so all the seasoning can go inside. A better view. Okay. So.
So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here. And I'm going to add water. I'm going to add some of this adobo. Moho, I'm sorry. Moho. And then some, um, maybe some chicken bunion cubes. Is it called bunion cubes? You don't add too much water because the water will actually come out the pot once you about to open it after they started cooking. So you don't pour in too much water. So I'm gonna pour that in there to give the water flavor. Maybe a little bit more. Excuse how I look, I was cleaning. I just was doing too much. Then I'm gonna have my drink. One of these in the water just one because the turkey wings already have a lot of seasoning to it so I'm gonna add one of these this is actually a crock pot a slow cooker and it's gonna take about a, maybe 30 minutes to cook maybe 30 minutes my turkey wings. I'm gonna fry my turkey wings because don't nobody like no plain looking meat. So when you fry the meat with the seasoning on there, it's gonna actually give it a brown look to it. And it's gonna have like a crispy taste to it as well. So I'm gonna just squeeze these inside the frying pan. I'm gonna put them in there. So they can brown on different sides. My husband does not eat turkey wings. He would he would eat a uh, turkey leg, but he don't eat. So I'm gonna have, I'm gonna take these carrots out of here. And I'm gonna put it in a crock pot with my potatoes. And I'm gonna give my husband and the girls broccoli with cheese. I'm gonna melt cheese on the broccoli so that it have a cheesy broccoli with their food. So I'm gonna turn the heat up a little bit more because it's taking too long. And I, all I wanna do is brown it. I just want to brown. I'm not trying to cook it. I'm going to brown it. I have some mushrooms to put inside the crock pot. I mean, you can put whatever you want to put inside the crock pot. Like, whatever vegetables you feel like you want to eat, throw it in there. It's nothing going to happen. What could happen? What could happen? Nothing. Let me go check on the girls because they're inside. They're quiet. But I need to check on them and see what they're doing. Don't move her too much, okay, baby? She didn't eat. That's she, fine. She was not hungry. Because she ate about an hour and a, two hours ago, she ate already. When is it? What are you cooking for dinner? You'll see. It's a surprise. <laughs> you want me to make the garlic naan? Mm -hmm. Bring, come, come cook it yourself, Alaja. Watch Alaja come running. Come cook it yourself. So it's actually frying a little bit faster. So I'm going to add butter at the bottom inside the um, water so that it can have a flavor to it. I'm sorry, guys, but this is how I like my food to be. I like my food to be nice, juicy. 
I can't wait. So this is actually cooking. So you're gonna check it and see if that side brown. It didn't brown yet, you see. So I'm gonna put it back down and let it brown some more. See, as you can see, the seasoning is all down there. So all that seasoning you put on there is gonna actually fall off the meat. It's gonna actually fall. So I'm gonna finish browning the meat and I'll be back for the, for the next step. So I'm gonna actually pick out some of the carrots and put it in a bowl with the potatoes and the uh, um, onions that I sauteed. This is how the meat look. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add these. Oh, look out, all that grease, it's grease. That's grease, that's grease, that's not sweat. So anyways, I'm gonna add the meat inside the slow cooker. It's not cooked at all. All I did was brown the meat. Because if you don't brown it, it's going to look pale. The meat will look pale. It will look like it's not cooked. So what you do is you season it and then you brown it. You brown the meat. And when you brown the meat, it actually have like a nice brown look to it. And you also cook in the seasoning inside the meat when you do that too. I always feel like it's an extra taste to it. A different taste. It's not gonna stay crispy like that. It's gonna actually get soft. So what I do is I put the um, seasoning on there, then I fry it. So that's that. Now I'm gonna actually pour this on top. Like so. Then what I'm going to do is, I'm going to leave this here. I'm going to put some of my mushrooms on there too. Just enough. Not too much. Maybe another handful. I mean, you can throw whatever you have in your refrigerator in there. It doesn't matter. Whatever you like, you just put it in there. So what I'm going to do now is put a little bit more seasoning because I feel like me, personally, it's not going to be seasoned well enough. So I'm going to throw some of this on here. More onion powder. And then I want to add a little butter at the top. It doesn't matter what you put in there, what seasoning you put. Put what's good for you. And it's going to come out so good. Trust me, I know. I know. So, that's that. I'm going to put the pot on there. I said I need a drink. I'm going to put 
lid on. Then I'm gonna close it, lock, it locks. I'm gonna close this because let me see, seal vent. Okay, seal vent. Push this down and then turn it. I don't know if this closes or not, but let me just turn it that way. And I'm gonna pull it out some so if it do steam, it comes out. So what I'm basically I'm gonna show you guys, I put it on steam because steam it cooks it fast. So I'm gonna put steam. It says 15 minutes. I'm gonna put it for. Does it? Can you see it? But I'm gonna put it for. Why is it not putting it? It's not letting me go up or down. I guess it's warming. Once it once it heat up, it'll let me turn it up or down. So it's not heated. So basically, it's gonna heat a little bit first, and then I'm going to cook my husband's shrimp and broccoli. And I'm gonna throw some rice in a pot, and that's it. Let's go check on the girls, cause they've been in there for too long. This is the number five. It keep going up. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stop it. So, you see that? To let the steam out. I'm gonna let the steam out. I don't know if you can see the steam coming up. You just keep letting it out until you don't hear anything or see any more steam coming out. You don't hear or see. It out for a while. So now it stopped. So now it lets you twist. If you was to try to twist this while it was really hot, it wouldn't open. So the fact that it twists, that means all the steam is out. Back up some Malaysia, please. So you got to back up and you got to open it slowly because it may pop out. So oh, you put that in there. Feels right done. Don't lie. You have to tell the truth. How does it taste? Is it seasoned well? Is it too salty? Is it too spicy? Is it juicy? Is it dry? Which one is it? Don't lie. Be real. Is it juicy or is it dry? It's good. Is it juicy? Yes, it's juicy. It's juicy. Yes. Is it too salty? 
No. Do I need to add any more seasoning? No. Can you just make my food? I'm hungry. There you go. Mmm.